What's wrong? They lost contact with the kid. Might be the collectors. Did your family get out of there? I don't know. No communications yet. The starboard observation deck is closed until needed. Access to life support is restricted. Hey, Shepard. This one security guy keeps staring at me. I think his name is Bert. I'm used to being watched by security, but they're usually staring at my eyes or watching my hands. I might have to start cloaking through the CIC from now on. I usually travel hidden away in cargo bays. It's nice to be able to look out a window for a change. Mess Sergeant Gardner might just be an evil genius. Emphasis on the evil. People think he's a bad cook on purpose, like he's trying to teach them a lesson. I think his ramen is okay, but it's really hard to ruin ramen. Weren't you originally stationed on Horizon? Yes. If I hadn't joined Cerberus, I'd be abducted by the Collectors right now. Wow. You really dodged a bullet. Yeah, I couldn't take that. They creeped the hell out of me. Commander Shepard. I watched the Normandy crumble with you on board. It's good to see you alive. Nice to see a familiar face, Doctor. I feel the same. I wish more of the original crew could be here. The kind of trauma you endured would have changed most people. But not you, I see. Welcome back, Shepard. Do you have everything you need? I believe so. This medical bay seems very much like the sick bay on the original Normandy. Only thing missing are my private reserves. I even had a bottle of Ceres Ice Brandy that I was saving for a special occasion. I'll keep an eye out for a replacement bottle. Oh, you needn't. It's expensive, and we have much larger concerns ahead. I'll see you later, Doctor. Commander. Shepard, I find myself in the unpleasant position of asking for your help. I don't like discussing personal matters, but this is important. Miranda, you're one of my crew. Tell me what's on your mind. You remember what I told you about Father? Building a dynasty? There was another reason I went to Cerberus for protection. I have a sister, a twin, and he's still hunting her. Cerberus has kept her safe, until now. She's living a normal life on Ilium, safe and hidden from my father. So you think your father's tracked her down? Precisely, Commander. My sources indicate he knows that she's on Ilium. I've tried to keep her hidden without impacting her life, but I'm out of options. He's too close. I need to relocate my sister's family before it's too late. What do you need me to do? My father is extremely persistent. I'd like to go to Ilium when Cerberus is moving the family to make sure none of his agents get too close. My contact's name is Lantea. She'll be waiting for us in the lounge near the Nurse Astra docking bay.
Hey. Tell me something I don't know about you. Nothing to tell. Why? I want to know more, and I'm not going away. I'm here to fight for you. Nothing says we have to be friends, but whatever. Something you don't know, huh? Obvious stuff, like what's up with my ink, or something else just as boring. You're not really interested unless it affects you. I've been through all this shit before. I could be genuine. You have no way of knowing. I have eyes, and I have history. You'll back off. As soon as you realize you're not the first, and I'm immune to your help. You work pretty hard at not letting people get close. I've been with lots of people. If you're asking about a boyfriend or a girlfriend, no. It's a waste of time and it never works. If you let someone get that close, it just means they need a shorter knife. Lonely and alive works just fine, thanks. Seems like you miss it a little more than you want to admit. Pick every little word apart if you want, but it doesn't change the way the galaxy works. Come on, you've been around. You're tough, but you can't have survived alone all these years. When I was starting out, I ran with this girl Minara and her boyfriend. They knew their way around. I thought they'd help me. Right. They helped me into their bed. And when we finally did take down something big, they helped themselves to my share of the take. I knew where it was heading, and I got them first. Never bothered with friends after that. I'll bite. What's with the tattoos? Some are for prisons I've been in. Some are for kills. You know, good ones. Some are for things I've lost. Those aren't your business. They're nobody's business. And some are because, hey, why the fuck not? I have to go, but we should do this again. Wait, my turn with the questions. People usually walk by now. Why are you really asking all these things? What's your game, Shepard? I've never met anyone like you. Whatever, it'll come back to what you can take. It always does. Later, Shepard. Shepard. Just checking in. Making sure you're acclimatizing. <laughs> I was just... <laughs> just sitting here thinking. The picture. I'm finally starting to get it. There's a tank imprint. The battle at Canrum. A dead Turian. Stripped. You don't see them out of their armor much. A Krogan boot on his head. And a claw hammer. It's under the brow plate. Pulling it back, right? Eyes have gone black, and you see tension in the muscle. You can feel it ready to snap. I get it. Canrum isn't ringing a bell. Death of Shiagar, female warlord. Turians killed her, so they were hunted down and made examples. Even if they won the war, it was the last push before the rebellions ended. I had to be there, but I don't get the joke. There's no joke. It's just great. It's a Turian, and he's being torn apart for what they did. I felt nothing before, but now I get it. It was a good fight. The enemy was destroyed to punish them all and send a message. I get it. 
I hate Turians. I thought you'd be glad. Don't start anything with Garrus. I won't have trouble on my ship. I don't hate Garrus. I hate the Turians. Garrus is just one Turian, and he's your clan. No point in ripping his face off unless he turns on me. It's hate, but it's mine. Okir was blind, and he tried to make me the same. But I'm starting to feel what they did. To see why I should care. Anyway, I'm still figuring where I fit, but it made me laugh. Nothing else really on my mind, Shepard. Jacob wants to speak with you. Commander, sorry I'm a little unfocused. Personal matter. It won't affect my duties. The yeoman said you wanted to see me. What's this about, Jacob? As I said, it's a personal matter. I don't want to waste our time if it... Turns out to be a goose chase, but... Well, I got pinged by a ghost the other night. Family. I'm listening. My private log got an update about the Hugo Gernsback, the ship my father served on. It sent an SOS last week, reporting a crash and requesting a rescue. Shepard, that ship went missing ten years ago. I hadn't talked to my father for three years before that. I've buried everything but a body. I'm not convinced it isn't just some automated distress signal ticking over. It's been too long. You'd like us to go take a look at the wreck, see if it's legit. If the coordinates aren't too far out of our way, I could at least verify the wreck. Who knows, maybe there is actually someone out there. I want to also mention that I don't make a habit of looking for random SOS signals. This was passed to my personal log through Cerberus filters. I think we can spare the time. Pass the coordinates to Joker. I appreciate that, Commander. I don't expect more than dusty old bones, but it'll be good to close the record.
Watch this area of the ship. That's all for now. launched. Launching probe. Probe away. launched. Launching probe. away. Probe launched. Probe away. Launching probe. Probe away.
Welcome to Nosastra, Commander Shepard. We've been instructed to waive all docking and administration fees for your visit. My name is Karina. If you need information about the area, it would be my pleasure to assist you. Who instructed you to waive the fees? The order came from Liara Tassoni, who paid all fees on your behalf. She also asked that I direct you to speak with her at your convenience. She's near the trading floor. You said Liara was here? What is she doing? Liara is one of Nosastra's most respected information brokers. Nosastra is based upon trade. Information is valuable currency, and Liara has done quite well. As I said, you'll find her near the trading floor. She was looking forward to seeing you. Thank you. Again, welcome to our city, Commander. Please enjoy your stay. Customs records indicated just a car named Samara is visiting this port, Shepard. Your former teammate, Liara Tassoni, may have more information. Her office overlooks the trading floor. You may wish to speak with her regarding the whereabouts of Thane Krios, the assassin. Her dossier, as well. Also no, you don't understand! I lost it somewhere near the... Pardon me, I'm on a call. 25. Sell at 25. No, no, no. You're not hearing me. I want to buy it. Holy crap, Shepard! I thought you were dead. Shepard? The news said you were dead. What happened? No, wait, probably classified. Forget I asked. You just have to lie. It's been a couple of years. I'm Gianna Parasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. You helped me nail Administrator Analeas. Happy to help. What happened to Administrator Analeas? He made the one mistake Novaria won't tolerate. He got caught taking their money. He's doing a few years in white collar prison. More importantly, he won't work in the field again. Sit down. If I remember right, I owe you a beer. What brings you to Ilium? You know, that you can talk about. You ever heard of the Collectors? They're attacking human colonies. I'm gonna stop them. Damn, Shepard. For me, a tough job involves more paperwork. Hey, listen, I just remembered something. I've gotta go. Talk to you later. And don't forget to drink your beer. I'm looking for... Welcome! You look like someone who needs high-quality equipment. Feel free to look around. My store has the best tech and biotic equipment on Ilium. Is everything here so expensive? I'd planned to drop a lot of credits today. Really? I'm outfitting a team for a dangerous mission. I need the best, and I'm willing to pay for it, as long as you work with me. Well, perhaps I could give you a preferred rate at the kiosk. Here, a small discount, and when I get special items in, you can take a look. What kind of special items are we talking about? Oh, you know, schematics, designs, nothing illegal, but I may not have all the licenses to sell them. Do you have anything else? Anything not listed on your main merchandise kiosk? Well, there is one thing. Very advanced design. Not publicly available yet. That's because it's still in development on Avaria, and illegal for export. Hello, Hermia. Parasini, you set me up! But this isn't Novaria. You don't have the authority to arrest me! I don't care whether you go to jail. I've got all the evidence I need to find you out of business. Do you have the authority to seize the schematic she's trying to sell? I don't have to. Hermia was under suspicion. We leaked a faulty device to her. All this thing will ever do is blow up in your face. I, I need to go. I have to talk to my lawyer. Talk fast, Hermia. When the fines hit, you won't be able to afford him. Ah, oh, that was good. I've got to go file a few papers. Come by my table when you've got a minute.
Hermia is going to be a very poor woman very shortly. Thanks for the help, Shepard. I love nailing Asari. So ageless and superior. Then you get them and they squeal like schoolgirls. It must be nice having a job that you really enjoy. I wanted to be a cop, or C-Sec, but my family had bills. I needed the money a corporate job brought in. Besides, in this job, you don't see things that make it hard to sleep at night. White-collar crime is nice and clean. Hell, at least this time I didn't have to wear heels and a dress. It's been a pleasure, Gianna. You too, Shepard. See you around. only to lose them to your competitors? Perhaps Indenture Tech can help, the leading provider of cutting... Have you faced an Asari commando Indenture unit before? Few humans have. I'll make it simple. Either you pay me, or I flay you alive. With my mind. Shepard! Nixeris, hold my calls. My sources said you were alive, but I never believed. It's very good to see you. It's good to see you too, Liara. How are you doing? I'm doing well. I've been working as an information broker. It's paid the bills since you... Well, for the past two years. And now you're back. Gunning for the Collectors with Cerberus. If you know that, then you know that I could use your help. I can't, Shepard. I'm sorry. I have commitments here. Things I need to take care of. What kind of things do you need to take care of? Are you in trouble? No, no trouble. But it's been a long two years. I had things to do while you were gone. I have debts to repay. Listen, if you want to help, I need someone with hacking expertise. Someone I can trust. If you could disable security at key points around Ilium, you could get me information I need. That would help me a great deal. What's this all about, Liara? Can't you just talk to me? Don't you think I want to, Shepard? This isn't because I don't trust you. This is Ilium. Anything I say is probably being recorded. If it'll help you, I'll take care of it. When you hack one, a server will open somewhere nearby for a short time. You can download data from there, if you hurry. Thank you, Shepard. This may help me pay a great debt. I'm looking for Thane Krios. He's supposed to be here on Ilium. The assassin? Yes. He arrived here a few days ago. My sources tell me he may be targeting a corporate executive, Nisana Dantius. He contacted a woman named Serena. Serena has an office in the cargo transfer levels. 
Perhaps she can tell you where Krios is. There's an Asari named Samara here on Ilium. Do you know where I could find her? Samara? Yes. She arrived recently and registered with Tracking Officer Dara. You can find Dara at the Transportation Hub. Thanks for the help. That's all I needed to know. Of course. If there's anything else I can help you with, let me know. How's your own work going? Everyone needs information, Shepard. You want to know why I don't drop everything to join you? I need to get that data. It should be about friendship, or trust. But that's not the way it works on Ilium. Let me know when you hack those terminals. Give me that, and I can talk to you. If it'll help you, I'll take care of it. When you hack one, a server will open somewhere nearby for a short time. Thank you, Shepard. This may help me pay a great debt. I'll talk to you later, Liara. Another difficult development for human expansion as the colony on Horizon has been attacked. The Council has pledged to investigate the matter thoroughly as a possible indication of attacks on humans galaxy-wide. Investors in prefabricated complexes are rejoicing, however, as the revealed Lots rebuilding of money plans here. have Soft people who make good wide. victims. This place is one bad day away from becoming Omega. I need minimal heat increase and speed. I have extremely high performance requirements. The Council thought that Blasto, the first NR Spectre, would play by the rules. This one. We'll figure something out. It's okay, I'll think of something. You said synthetic insights would buy me. You said it was an easy sale. I assumed they would want an AI tech. Hello. Can I help you with something? I need you to let that slave go. Now. We prefer the term indentured servant. And I know that Batarian slavers have made humans understandably prejudiced against slavery. Before you do anything hasty, know that this Quarian signed the agreement voluntarily, and her servitude contract is completely legal on Ilium. If you actually want to help the quarry and convince the Synthetic Insights representative to purchase her contract. What if I bought her myself? I could let her go and everyone would be happy. A gallant offer with three problems. First, her technical skill merits a contract of several hundred thousand credits. There is also a fee for freeing me before my service period ends. Exactly. And finally, you are clearly a traveler. Her service contract requires that she remain on Ilium. I don't want them to take me off to a mine somewhere. I'll talk to the Synthetic Insights rep and see what I can do. Really? Thank you. I'd appreciate that. So then he says... Oh, it's okay. Our amino acids are all different, so it's not like... Can I help you with something? you like to get your hands on an expert Quarian AI programmer? If you'd like to submit a resume, I... Wait, is this that slave? Synthetic Insights has no interest in purchasing slave labor. We're under enough scrutiny from the Citadel without engaging in practices the Council disapproves of. To be frank, we're hardly hiring anyone. The Geth attack on the Citadel didn't engender much love for artificial intelligence. Sounds like Synthetic Insights is worried about its reputation. Hiring this Quarian would help. Buying a slave helps our reputation. How exactly do you figure? Purchase the contract, minus the fee for early emancipation, then free the Quarian and garnish wages for reimbursement. Interesting. We look good for hiring a Quarian, and we can say that we freed slaves out of the goodness of our hearts. All right, I'll run up a contract. The board might wet its pants, but we could use the good publicity. This Quarian had better be good, though. Synthetic Insights just sent over the contract. I cannot thank you enough. 
I'm happy to help. Here, for your trouble. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll get this service contract transferred. Thank you. I'll stay out of trouble this time. You deserve somebody who respects you. Somebody who's going to treat you. Ms. Lawson, I'm glad you've made it. We've had a complication. What happened? Is Ariana all right? She's fine, but you listed a man named Niket as your trusted source. He contacted me, warning that your father has sent Eclipse mercenaries to make a sweep. He suggested that the mercs might be watching for you personally. He's offered to escort Ariana's family to the terminal instead. It's your sister, Miranda. What do you want to do? Lentea, we'll follow Niket's suggestion. Shepard and I will take the car and draw their attention. Have Niket escort the family to the shuttle. Give him full access to the family's itinerary, just to be safe. Understood, Ms. Lawson. So the plan is for us to get shot down by Eclipse while your sister gets to safety? Eclipse will be under orders to take my sister alive. They won't risk anything that could kill us. I'm ready whenever you are, Miranda. Thank you, Shepard. I appreciate this. I hadn't planned on Eclipse, but they never planned on you. mercenary gunships. They'll be dropping troops in the cargo areas. Put us down in that cover behind them. Let's hope they really do want to take us alive. <laughs> Damn it! Since you're not firing yet, I trust you know who I am. Yeah, they said you'd be in the car. You're the bitch that kidnapped our boss's little girl. Kidnapped? This doesn't involve you. I suggest you take your men and go. Think you've got it all lined up, huh? Captain Inyala's already moving in on the kid. She knows about Niket. He won't be helping you. I'm giving you one chance to leave. That's more than most get. Captain Inyala ordered us to give you one chance to walk away. This whole time we've been talking, my men have been lining up shots. When I say the word, we unleash hell on your squad. So I suggest you walk away nicely, unless you want... They've seen us.
it. Hang on, I've got one of their radios. I'll patch us in, see if I can get an idea of what we're up against. Shepard, I think I owe you an explanation. Ariana is my twin, genetically. But my father grew her when I was a teenager. She was meant to replace me. I couldn't let my father do to her what he did to me. So I rescued her. She's almost a woman now. If Eclipse knows where Oriana is, they'll be moving in on her soon. We need to hurry. Agreed. I'm a bit worried by what the Merc said. If they've got to Niket somehow, this is going to be harder than I'd planned. According to the specs I reviewed, we'll need to cut through the cargo processing yard to get to Oriana. Let's go find Niket and Oriana. Right. They're on the far side of the conveyor line. Time your shots. useful. Ooh. 
contact. Oh. Ah. One down. Ready to fight. Maybe the captain knows we're listening in, and she's feeding misinformation about Niket making a switch. Or maybe it means something else. Niket wouldn't do that. Damn it, why won't the thing go any faster? What makes you so sure that Niket wouldn't turn on you? He could have turned on me when I ran away. I'm sure my father tried to buy him off. If he didn't do it then, why would he do it now? Did Niket know that you took Oriana from your father? No, he just found out about that recently. It was too personal to involve someone else. I never really thought about it, but maybe... No, he'd have to understand why I did it. He knows what I went through. We won't know anything until we find Niket. And then I'll have a word with this Captain and Yala. Listen to me, I've got authorization to change their booking. I'm sorry, sir. We're under security lockdown. Until the situation in the cargo terminal is resolved, no passengers can be rebooked. This isn't worth my time, Niket. I get paid regardless of how the girl gets there. No, I was told that I could handle this my way. We're not traumatizing the family any more than we...
theory. This should be fun. civilians around. We can end this here and now. Not before I get some answers. Why, Niket? You were my friend. You helped me get away from my father. Yes, because you wanted to leave. That was your choice. But if I'd known that you'd stolen a baby... I didn't steal her. I rescued her. From a life of wealth and happiness? You weren't saving her. You were getting back at your father. If Niket knows about Oriana, then your father does too. Relocating her won't work. Miranda's father has no information about Oriana. I knew you had spy programs in your father's system, Miri, so I kept it private. I'm the only one who knows. Which means that you're the only loose end. This isn't how I wanted it to end, Niket. Miranda, wait. You don't want to do this. This has to end here, Shepard. My father will keep trying to find Oriana. Maybe Niket can help. Talk to your father. Just say you got here first. Oh, I'll tell him that you hid her. That I don't know where she is. I never want to see you again, Niket. <laughs> Done. Now, if you don't mind, I have a shipment to deliver. You'll die for that, bitch! There could be more Eclipse Mercs near the shuttle. I want to make sure Oriana and her family get on safely. I can't believe Niket sold me out. I didn't even see it coming. Even with all your upgrades, you're human just like the rest of us. But I let it get personal and I screwed up. Why didn't you let me kill him? I could have handled that. But watching him get gunned down by that Asari bitch. You still cared for him, even if he betrayed you. You're right. And my father knew it. He used that against me. It's always been like this. My father gave me anything I ever wanted. But there was always a hook, an angle for his long-term plan. I threw away everything he ever gave me when I ran. Except Niket. Weakness on my part? You still have Oriana. My father didn't give her to me. I rescued her. Yes, you're right. I still have something. Thank you. No sign of Eclipse. It looks like we're clear. 
There she is. She's safe. With her family. Come on, we should go. Don't you even want to say hello? It's not about what I want, it's about what's right for her. The less she knows about me, the better. She's got a family. A life. I'll just complicate that for her. She doesn't need any details, but would it really be so bad for her to know she has a sister who loves her? I guess not. Go on. We'll wait here. If you're hurting for things to do, maybe after work we could catch a bit or something. I still don't see why we're here. Salarians do not get married. My family simply negotiated a reproduction contract. Whatever. What's this? Do you have anything flashier? I want something that says, I own this world. I own you. I'll see you. 
Asari building structure resembles hive. Tall buildings filled with drones. Mm, curious social dynamic. Many queens competing for hive leadership. Odd feelings around Asari. Unfamiliar. Reminders of old fertility contract negotiations. The data is vital to the Carosa family. Cassandra Dantius didn't give us time to pack. Lucky I got out at all. Her mercenaries were starting to shoot. If she lets us back in, I'll get it, I promise. If not, well, we'll just have to hope. Excuse me, I'm on an important call. wants to know someone who can make your life a living hell <laughs> too late Liara to Sony said you'd have information on Thane Krios am I wasting my time Tana cover for me over here yeah I know who Thane Krios is I might have passed him some information but I didn't hire him what do you want to know I just need to talk to him. Dangerous man to chat with. Your call, though. I ran security for Nasana Dantius. Then I found out she was having people killed to cover up her dirty secrets. She fired me when I confronted her. Her loss. I might have been good enough to stop Thane from taking her down. Just tell me where I can find Thane. The Dantius Towers. Penthouse level of Tower 1.
There's a second tower, still under construction. If Thane is smart, he'll go in from there. I'll find him. Not without some help. You don't just walk into the Dantius Towers, especially now. Suggestions? I can get you in, but you'll only get one shot. You'd better be ready. I'll be back in a bit. I'll be here, but I wouldn't wait too long. Trust me, the goods coming in from the Terminus systems are great for business. I don't know, some of them seem dangerous. That's the whole point. Danger means more contract work for us. No, I haven't had any luck yet. She insists it was recon. I don't know. I'm going to call in a favor and have a friend sign the contract. Shepard. I... I don't suppose you'd remember me. I'm Shiala. We met on Pharos during the Geth attack. Saren had given me to the Thorian creature as a slave, and you killed it, and saved me. I promised to help Zeus Hope recover. I'm actually here on Ilium for just that purpose. How's Zeus Hope doing? We've done a lot of rebuilding. We even salvaged some useful material from the Geth ship you destroyed. The Exogeny researchers got called back to their headquarters, however along with what was left of the Thorian. Is there something I can do to help? I'd appreciate it. I've reached the limits of my diplomatic abilities, and I'd prefer not to start trouble. Some of the colonists had health problems as a result of the Thorian control. We hired a colonial survey group to do some medical scans, but the medical contract apparently allows the company to perform invasive procedures without our consent. That's why I'm here. I'll talk to the survey group. I appreciate it, Shepard. The Baria Frontier's representative knows about the issue. I saw your conversation, human. You're here to complain about the medical contracts those colonists from Pharaoh signed. I suggest you leave. Your life is short enough. Do not waste what time you have bothering me. What's your problem with humans? <sighs> not just humans, it's all of you. The Salarians and Turians are no better. The galaxy would be a better place if nobody but the Asari had ever dragged themselves out of the primordial muck. I thought Asari preferred to mate with other races for genetic diversity. A short-sighted mistake perpetrated by the same self-hating malcontents who spawned the hateful term pure blood. We hardly need your alien DNA to randomize genetic material. A little radiation would work just as well. You provide no diversity, no new insights, no advancement. You bring only chaos and senseless deaths. Ah. Whose deaths are we talking about exactly? The mother of my daughters was killed on the Quarian homeworld during the initial Geth uprising. My daughters died on the Citadel when the Geth attacked. One worked in the embassy. The other was a greeter for the consort. I'm not speaking in hypotheticals, human. The aliens will never be my allies. The best they can do is give me useful medical data. 
Your bondmate was with the Quarians. Your daughters worked with aliens every day at the Embassy and the Consort. And look what happened to them! You've suffered, I get that. But these colonists were trying to live peacefully. They've suffered too. They lost family to the Geth and the Thorian creature. Don't add to their anguish. Oh. I'm sending an amended contract. No more tests, no fees. There's enough grief in this galaxy. I don't need to add to it. Did you get the star charts? Yeah. I had to deal with Arrhenia, though. I feel like I need a shower. What? You did it! I just got the revised contracts. Thank you, Shepard. You've saved Zeus Hope again. I don't think I could have... Is it always like this? Yesterday's problems lingering in some new form. Isn't anything ever just fixed? You've got the new contracts. It's fixed for now. Thank you for what you've done here, Shepard. I'll keep doing what I can. Maybe sometime when I'm not organizing the colony and you're not doing whatever you do. For example, you know that new drug, the one that causes permanent neural scarring? I'm telling you, relax. Vax will never notice a few missing pieces. No, I can't get in. Because it's a crisis. Blue Rose of Helium. Let your roots dig deep into the hot soil of Tachanka. Let our scorching sun and sheeting rain turn your summer into stress. For if our love is to survive, it must grow thorns to pierce the hands of any.
You're sure gateway weapons and armor are good enough for Eclipse? Yeah, I've got a friend in Eclipse. She told me what I needed to get. Good. You can sell something that dangerous with just a contract and a waiver? These are the Terminus systems. Everything's dangerous. And everything's for sale. to see you again. Thank you for getting me that system data. Here, it's not much, but hopefully it will help you on your mission. Do you remember the Shadow Broker? With the data you got me, I may be able to find information caches from his agents. Are you on the run from the Shadow Broker? I can help you. Actually, it would be more accurate to say that the Shadow Broker is on the run from me. We crossed paths not long after you died. Since then, I've been working to take him down. With this data, I'm a step closer. I've never seen you ready to execute someone in cold blood. What did the Shadow Broker do to you? I was on a job with a friend. The Shadow Broker's people caught us. My friend didn't escape. I don't know if he's dead or being interrogated. But I need to find him. I owe him my life. And I need to make the Shadow Broker pay for what he did. You can't come with me because you're after the Shadow Broker? What if I help you find him? I'm sorry, Shepard. The galaxy doesn't work that way. I need to find leads, trace information. I need to work. I can't do that on the Normandy. I wish I could. Let me know if there's anything else I can do. Thanks, Shepard. I will. Now, is there anything else I can help you with? I know you're looking for the Shadow Broker. Cerberus gave me data on where to find him. Interested? Absolutely. I had no idea. Let me see what you've got. It looks like a leaked transmission between Shadow Broker operatives. Some hint says to the location, and... It's about Farron. He's still alive. Who's Farron? He was a friend. He helped me recover your body from the Shadow Broker. Why did the Shadow Broker want my corpse? He was going to sell you to the Collectors, but Farron and I stopped him. Farron sacrificed himself to save me. So... you rescued me? Then how did I end up with Cerberus? Well, they gave me intel to help recover you. They actually put Farron with me in the first place. After I got out, I gave you to them. They said they could bring you back. You kept me out of the Collector's hands. Without you, I couldn't have come back. Thank you. You don't know what that means to me, Shepard. I didn't know who you'd be when you came back. If you'd feel... They brought you back. And now they're giving me a chance to find Farron. After two years, I hadn't even dreamed. Any friend of yours is a friend of mine. What's the next step? I... I don't know. I need to prepare to think. I'm going home. Use my terminal if you need any local intel. You okay? I've spent two years plotting revenge. Now I have the chance to make it a rescue. Let me help. I'll come by your apartment. Okay. Hopefully I'll have a plan by then. Thank you, Shepard.
Life can be uncertain. That's why you need an Omnigel programming solution that works. Whether constructing... That still sounds like an awful thing to legalize. All the dangers are right there on the package. It's... Can I help you with something? I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. Wait, why? Do you have a problem, or... Did she kill somebody already? Relax. I just need to speak with her. Good. Samara's the first Justicar I've seen on Ilium. If I'm lucky, things will stay peaceful. She went to the commercial spaceport a few hours ago. If you want to get there, the pedestal on that balcony will summon a cab. Just be polite when you meet her. Justicars embody our highest laws, and they usually stay in Asari space. She's not used to dealing with aliens. Thanks for your help. Good luck with the Justicar. Try not to piss her off. Telling you, relax. Thax will never notice a few missing pieces. No, I can't get in. Because it's a crime scene. It's a crime scene. Cliff Stark, so just a car. Seal off those trace samples and get them back to the lab. We got multiple shots fired. Yeah, techs are going over the place now. Central, we got an open carrier on this end. Switching to a coded relay. What's going on? This area is sealed off. Please step back, ma'am. Sealed off? Why? Someone tried to kill your friend, Commander Shepard. Thank you, officer. Your people are dismissed. You can't do that. Already done. Tila Vasir, Special Tactics and Recon. As Spectre? I heard your status was reinstated. Good. You're one of our most famous operatives. Might even get you to sign my chest plate. So, I assume you had business with your friend this evening, Commander. Liara was following a lead on the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? Dangerous enemy to have. What are the facts so far? About 25 minutes ago, someone took a shot at Tissoni. Note the bullet holes. She stuck around for almost four minutes before leaving the building. Whatever she was doing was important. Did the police find anything when they arrived? Just the mess and the bullet holes. I gave them a gold star for finding the bullet holes. Liara was expecting me. She would have left a message here. Her office wasn't safe. I'm not surprised. Ilium is just Omega with expensive shoes. I haven't found anything useful for tracking her down yet. You knew Tissoni better than I do. 
Where would she have hidden her backups? Let me take a look around. The rifle used to do that wasn't standard issue. The kinetic barrier deflected the shots, but they still managed to penetrate the glass. It's part of my old armor. Looks like someone didn't like you much either. A doctorate from the University of Ceres, Alessia. She's getting good use out of all that education. Well, that's not the Asari homeworld. I'm not sure what planet that is. It's Ilos. The picture changed when you touched it. It must be keyed to your ID. What does it show now? It's a Prothean dig site. Liara did leave a message. There are a few Prothean-looking objects around the apartment. Let's see what we can find. Those things must be worth a fortune. Seer, I've got something here. Backup disk. Let's try it on her terminal. It looks like she recorded a call. What have you got for me, Sigat? It was tricky, but you paid for the best. I can narrow it down to a cluster, maybe even a system. How soon can you have it? Shouldn't take long. Come to my office. Barrier Frontiers in the Dracon Trade Center. Gotta say, though, to Sony. You're making me a little nervous. How big is the trouble that could come out of this? Relax, Sikat. I'll see you in a few hours. This must be important. The Shadow Brokers people already tried to kill her once. I know where the Dracon Trade Center is. My car's outside. Let's go. Frontier's offices are located on the third floor. I don't hear police chatter. We must have missed the party. Liara's in there! This could be a problem. They just took out three floors to make sure she's dead. I'll grab this guy car and seal off the building from the top. I'll start down here and work my way up. Just leave some for me. Who are you? What's going on? Security is down. No alarms, no police. Very professional. Thanks to us and companies like X Solar Shipping. Bing, 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 bing. Barrier Frontier employee. Looks like he got caught in the explosion. I wouldn't take any bets on just Sony 
Frank's informant surviving that blast. Vizier, I'm at the Barrier Frontiers office. Liara signed in just a few minutes ago. Understood, Welcome Commander. Barrier Frontiers. Let us be your guide to the Expansion, exploration. Vizier, I'm pinned down, marked, and they're well armed. Say hello to the Shadow Brokers' private army commander. Going down. Here. These damaged pipes are on fire. They're blocking the stairs. Got it. Should be clear now. Good. I'm on my way down. useful.
Damn it. If I'd have been a few seconds faster, I could have stopped them. Is this Sakat? Must have been. No sign of that data Liara talked about. Looks like a dead end. Uh, speaking of which, did you find your friend's body? You mean this body? Liara! Something I should know? This is the woman who tried to kill me. You've had a rough day, so I'll let that slide. Why don't you put that gun down? I saw you. I doubled back after I left. I watched you break into my apartment. So what? You were just using me to find the message? Nothing personal, Shepard. Just needed a little help tracking down Liara. Once she had my location, she signaled the Shadow Broker's forces. They bombed the building to take me out. She found Sakat, took his data, and killed him. I'm guessing she's still got the disc on her. Good guess. Not that you'll ever see what's on it. You pure blood bitch! There she is. 
Turning right. No wait left. I'm on her. Hang a left. She's around the corner. We're not going into the construction site, are huh? Oh, goddess. We need to go faster. I'm not letting her escape with that dude. I'm not letting her escape with that data. Go, 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 go! I'm going! Traffic! Oncoming traffic! We'll be fine. She's dropping proximity charges. I noticed. Wonderful. Truck! I know. Truck! I know! There we go. You're enjoying this. A head on collision at this speed. Yeah, I hear those pretty bad. Again? Watch out. Damn back. Watch out. They're dropping reinforcements. There's Vizier's car. Come on, she can't have gotten far. Watch out. They're dropping reinforcements to slow us down.
shield your eyes. over to get to Vizier's car. Luxury resort with an exotic edge. Azure is slang for a part of the Asari body in some areas of Ilio. Where? Mainly the lower reaches, near the bottom. I meant where on the Asari body. So did I. Interesting. She's lost a lot of blood. We have to be getting close. She's tough, I'll give her that much. She's a specter. Vizier, it's over. Hey! Hey, you! Come here. What's your name? M mariana Mariana, you want to live, don't you? Tell those people that you want to live. Please. We'll get you out of here safely, Mariana. Well, that's good to hear. All you had to do was walk away. Now it gets ugly. Please, I have a son. A son? I hope he gets to see you again. I've heard losing a parent is just horrific for children. Scars them for life. I'm going to end you, Fazir. It's okay, Liara. We'll handle it. The usual way. You want Mariana's little boy to grow up without a mommy, Shepard? Thermal clips on the ground now. Power cells too. Is that it? What? Vizier, 
I let the Destiny Ascension die with 10,000 people on board, including the Council. I unleashed the Rachni on the galaxy. So for your sake, I hope your escape plan doesn't hinge on me hesitating to shoot a damn hostage. You're bluffing. Now, Liara. <laughs> Shockwave! Oh.
here they come. Watch out, shockwave! data pad. This has what we need to find the Shadow Broker. You're dead. The Shadow Broker has been in power for decades. He's stronger than anything you've ever faced. Is that why you sold out the Council to work for him? You think I betrayed the Council? Like Saren? Go to hell. The Broker's given me damn good intel over the years. Intel that saved lives and kept the Citadel safe. So if the Broker needs a few people to disappear, I'll pay that price without hesitation. Spectres don't blow up buildings filled with innocent people. Sure we do. We get our hands dirty so the Council doesn't have to. The Councilors might complain about our methods to soothe their consciences, but they never look too closely. Besides, you're with Cerberus. You have any idea what your terrorist friends have done? I know who they are and what they've done. It doesn't matter. I think it does. You want to judge me? Look in the mirror. Kidnapping kids for biotic death camps? Killing Alliance admirals who ask questions? And you're with them? Don't you dare judge me. Oh. Don't you? Sony had retrieved the data. Civilian casualties, not a concern. Vizier's dead. I'm putting the data through to the Normandy's computers. We can be at the Shadow Broker's base in a few hours. He'll know about Vizier before long. If he decides to kill Farron. We'll get Farron out of there alive, Liara. I promise. I know. You're here to help. Just like always. That's not a good thing. When we first met on Therum, you saved me from the Geth. You fought a Krogan Battlemaster while I cowered. Now you're doing it again. And I'm still leaning on you for help. That's what friends do, Liara. I can get us there based on Sakat's data. 
The Normandy stealth drive will keep them from detecting us. The Shadow Brokers agents are still shooting their way through Ilium. With luck, they won't notice we've left until it's too late. That's a little cold. They killed innocent people. You know what I mean. Do I? When I hit the ground back at the Trade Center, you went after Vizier without a backward look. A little fall wasn't going to kill you. I had to stay on Vizier. I had to stay rational, make the call, like I did with Sakat. That's Vizier's fault, not yours. Sakat had no idea what the stakes were. I put him in harm's way to get the data I needed. I got him killed, and I'd do it again. But from here on out, things will be simple. Get in, get Farron, get out. And kill anyone who tries to stop us. That's it? That's it. We just stop for a second? We'll be jumping several light years. There's time to talk. About what? You haven't been the same since I came back, Liara. What do you want me to say, Shepard? That I mourned you? That I feel guilty because Farron got captured? I made mistakes. I lost people. I helped get you back, and I want to do the same for Farron. I'll sit and talk once he's safe. Until then, enjoying the scenery is an insult to the man who saved both of us. Okay, let's go. Snap freeze ten minutes after sundown. The Shadow Broker lives in this? His ship follows the sunset, completely undetectable in the storm, unless you know where to look. How do we get inside? The shuttle bay is locked down. We'll need to land on the ship and hunt for a hatch. But we can't stay outside for long. There's a constant lightning storm where the hot and cold air collide. <laughs> from a communications array near the back of the ship. There's nothing below but maintenance equipment. We have to find an entrance near the back shielding. Enemy 
combat drone. Navigating this storm is brutal. If the ship's engines stop even for a moment, at least the Shadow Broker would go down with us. That's comforting.
Agents love patrolling the hall. At least the view is nice. There. That hatch leads directly to the communication signals. It's locked. Hang on, I've got a bypass shunt program that can crack it. How long will it take? I don't know, Shepard. I've never broken into the Shadow Broker's base before. Well, not this one, anyway. Because of shot, ready. You sure that shot is working? It's illegal, even on Ilium. It didn't come with a warranty. But you tested it, right? Here come more of them. How did you test it?
carry him. There we go. Please don't give the mercs ideas. Watch for drone. Ah. toward the prison block. Hold on. 
We're getting you out of here. No. Farron. I thought this looked too easy. This chair plugs into the broker's info network. You have to shut off the power. Pull me out now and my brain cooks. Do you know where we can cut the power? It won't be easy. You'll have to go to Central Operations. Tell us where to go. Central Operations is down the hall. You know the Shadow Broker's waiting for you, right? I'm counting on it. We'll be back for you, Farron. I'll try not to go anywhere. I want all teams to outpost C. Get an LOS. Aim the Reckless, just determined. Ask your Asari Spectre about that. Monsieur was expendable. All her death cost me was time. Expendable like Farron? Dr. Dasoni, your interference caused all this. Farron betrayed me when he handed you Shepard's body. The Drell is simply paying the price. Be smart. Let Farron walk out with us. You won't be walking out. You're quite confident for someone with nowhere left to hide. You travel with fascinating companions, Doctor. It's good you brought Archangel to Sony. Your friend's bounty is still unclaimed. You're not putting a hand on anyone. It's pointless to challenge me, Asari. I know your every secret while you fumble in the dark. Is that right? You're a Yogg. A pre-space flight species quarantined to their homeworld from massacring the Council's first contact teams. This base is older than your planet's discovery. Which probably means you killed the original Shadow Broker 60 years ago, then took over. I'm guessing you were taken from your world by a trophy hunter who wanted a slave. Or a pet. How am I doing? Kinetically sensitive. Energy and projectiles are bouncing off. Then we do this the hard way. Hit him now!
can get him to bring up that shield again, I've got an idea. online. Resume standard procedures. I want a status report on all operations within the next solar day. Shadow Broker, out. Goddess of Oceans, it's you. You... how? Well, everyone who's ever seen him in person is dead, so... You're the new Shadow Broker. Is taking over as the Shadow Broker really a good idea? It was either that or lose everything. His contacts, his trading sources, those will really help us. With the Shadow Broker's information network, I can... I can give you... I can... I'll check the power systems. different people. You have your mission, and... Okay. 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 But... we should focus. Let's see what our options are. No safeguards or user restrictions. It's like he never anticipated anyone but himself being here. And it's all ours. You sure you want to stay here? I could use you on the Normandy. I have to stay here. We can't pass this up, Shepard. All I wanted was to rescue Farron, but 
Is it wrong that part of me wants this? With the Shadow Brokers network, I can help you. Maybe I can turn this operation into something better. Don't be a stranger this time. Small chance of that. Come back soon. Welcome back, Shadow Broker. What's this? That's the old broker's VI assistant. It's actually been helpful with rebuilding the network. Please let me know if I can organize anything else for you, Shadow Broker. It also thinks anyone in the room is the broker. I'll play around with the settings later. My manual is ready whenever you have a moment.
It's nearly time to repurchase a... How are you doing, Liara? I'm a bit overwhelmed, to be honest. The Shadow Broker had more resources than you can imagine. Here, come on over. He had top-level access to the Turian and Asari governments. And more than one Solarian Dalatros traded intel. At least I get to share it with you. You're not gonna turn into a recluse with creepy information on everyone in the galaxy, are you? I can understand the temptation. I've got all the secrets of the galaxy at my fingertips. Give me ten minutes and I could start a war. But I've got a purpose. Helping you stop the Reapers. That will keep me honest. You know, relatively speaking. Have you found anything useful yet? The Shadow Broker knew about the Reapers. Perhaps that's why he offered to help prove Saren's guilt to the Council. He didn't want Saren to succeed. He knew you weren't lying about your visions of the Prothean Beacon. There's even some data on the Protheans. I think he knew what was coming and was looking for a way to survive. How's Farron doing? As well as you'd expect, after two years of intermittent torture. He gonna be okay? I don't know. He wants to work, so I'm letting him help. Maybe it takes his mind off it. How'd you know what the Shadow Broker was? I didn't. I had no idea what to expect when we finally found him. But I researched pre-space flight cultures during some of my Prothean studies. I knew a bit about the Yogg. There's more on the terminals if you want to look. They're a fascinating culture, and a terrifying one. Why was he still looking at Protheans? They gave us the warning in the conduit at Ilos, but we've used those. The Shadow Broker seemed to think there was more out there. Perhaps the Protheans had other plans. Or maybe he was just grasping at anything that offered some hope. You know, I didn't come down here just to talk about Data. Look, about the kiss. We just finished the fight. I miss you, but it's been two years. I don't want to put pressure on you. I've got fond memories of the last time you put pressure on me. <laughs> so do I. Why don't you come to the Normandy for drinks? I'd like that. Good. Get your things and come on up. Okay, thanks. I'll be right there. Just give me a minute. Did you enjoy the tour? Yes, it's a beautiful ship, and I ran into Joker. He seemed happy to see me. Although he did ask if you and I would be acting out scenes from some vid called Vanya. Of course he did. I also spoke with Dr. Chalkwaz. I'm glad she's doing well. I brought you something. It took some digging, but... I recovered your tags. I thought I'd never see these again. You can't get back everything you lose, but sometimes you get lucky. Yeah, that was the plan. How are you actually doing, Shepard? I mean, really. Not what you tell your squad to keep morale up. no idea how we're gonna do this. I'm doing everything I can, but... You've done more than most. There wouldn't be a man, woman, or child left on Horizon, if not for you. I saved some of them. Not enough. And the Collectors will keep hitting colonies until I stop them. So you'll stop them? 
And here I thought it'd be difficult. You'll get the job done. You always do. I just don't know what comes next. So tell me what you want. If this all ends tomorrow, what happens to us? I don't know. Marriage, old age, and a lot of little blue children. You just say these things. Goddess, you were dead. I got better. This time, but you're going to leave again. When your team is ready, you'll leap through the Omega-4 relay. I spent two years mourning you. So if we're going to try this, I need to know you're always coming back. Pretty big promise to make. Oh, is it? I'd have to have something special to come back to. I'm open to suggestions. How about this? Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. I don't know what to feel about Grunt. My psych reports were for Oak here. We have no guarantees that Grunt is mentally stable. I get the feeling he just doesn't care about anything, including who lives or dies. Don't worry, Kelly. I wouldn't let him touch you. If there's any touching being done, you'd better be involved. Anyway, what's up? That'll be all. It's always nice chatting with you.
I got thoughts, like little bugs crawling in and out of my head. I can't stop them. You know I have a history with Cerberus. You know how far back it goes? I'll listen to anything you have to say, Jack. Your pal, the elusive man? Never seen him before, but Cerberus raised me. First thing I remember is my cell door in a Cerberus base. They did experiments, drugged me, tortured me. Whatever chance I had to be normal, they stole it by trying to turn me into some superbiotic. The doctors, the other kids, every one of them hated me. They let me suffer. How did you get out of there? There was some kind of emergency and I made a break for it. The other kids came out of their cells and attacked me. So did the guards. I just killed everything in my way and ran. Guess my biotics had developed faster than they thought. I managed to get a shuttle off the ground. Drifted until a freighter picked me up. The crew used me. Then sold me. That's my uplifting escape story. other children in the base? I didn't know much about them. I was kept separate. They hated me just like everyone else there. When I broke out, I had to fight through them all. I showed them, but there's a loose end I need to deal with. You're absolutely certain that Cerberus was running the facility? I was a kid, but I wasn't dumb. I know how to listen. It was Cerberus. Don't care how far down the chain it was. They thought they were so clever. Turns out, mess with someone's head enough and you can turn a scared kid into an all-powerful bitch. 
fucking idiots. I'm going to talk to the elusive man, and he'd better have some answers. He'll just deny everything. That's not what I'm after anyway. I found the coordinates in your files. I want to go to the Telton facility on Pragia, where they tortured and drugged me. I want to go to the center of the place myself. I want to deploy a big fucking bomb, and I want to watch from orbit when it goes. I'll set a course for Pragia. I owe you, Shepard. seems very agitated. You may want to check in on him. Chamber said you're tearing up the place. Something wrong? Something is wrong, Shepard. I feel wrong, tense. I just want to kill something with my hands. More so than usual. Like it's not my choice. Like I just want to, I don't know. <laughs> See, why do that? What's wrong? Kira Krogan probably starts more aggressive than most. I'm not seeing this as a particularly big shift. Doesn't matter if it's normal. I'm not. I'm not used to this... this noise. I want control. When we're moving, fighting, I focus. But here, my blood screams, my plates itch, and even you are just noise. I'm tank-born. What is this? Don't know if I can help, Grunt. Sounds like we need one of your kind to look into this. Most off-world Krogan are warriors. Doctors don't leave the homeworld to Junka. I won't ask you to go there. I will control this. Joker can get us to the Krogan homeworld. I need everyone at their best. Thank you, Shepard. I don't like this. Fury is my choice, not a sickness. Requests to see you. 